As always, I started by sketching Mario on my iPad with my Procreate app. I will give you a moment to take a screenshot so that you could follow along with me. Once completed the sketch, add it to your canvas on Illustrator. I'm using a 1280 by 720 pixel canvas. Create a reference locked layer for the sketch and two other layers named outline and color. For the outline, we will use a black stroke with rounded caps and corners. Start by creating the nose with a circle. Make sure it is centered to the canvas. To create the upper part of the mustache, we will use an oval, which we will align with the sketch. With a pen tool, create three straight lines and end it at the center point. Using the curvature tool, select each line and curve it by clicking and dragging. Since we only created the left side, select the lines and activate the Reflect tool. Hold Option or Alt on your keyboard and click in the middle. Select Vertical and click on Copy. Now let's combine these shapes to create the mustache. Select All, activate the Shape Builder tool and click on the gray area to create a new shape. We can select the other shape and delete it. Following this method, we can create the eyes, the eyebrows, and the mouth area. With the pen tool, draw the left side of the face only. Just make sure to end your point at the center. Create the hat with the use of the ellipse and the Shape Builder tool. Alright, so to make the illustration look more interesting, we are going to taper off some lines with the use of the Width tool. Just select the strokes and play with the thicknesses by clicking and dragging on them. Perfect, now is the time to add the base colors, and as promised, I will show you my new and improved coloring way. Select all and head over to the Layers panel. Hold Option or Alt and drag the green square down to the color layer. We have now duplicated the outline. Working on the color layer only, delete some unnecessary lines like the mouth area and the ears detail. Head over to the Tools panel and select the Paint Bucket tool. 
with this tool, with a fill color only, that I will use from my DOM designs color palette, select each individual section and apply a base color to it. We can add some skin color, color in the mustache and hairs with a dark brown, and give it a bright red and blue for the clothes. As you can see, when I select it, it's all grouped together. So to separate it, head over to the object menu and select expand. Have object, fill and stroke check marked and confirmed by clicking on OK. Ungroup all and select the outline and delete it. We can turn on the outline layer in order to show the original line work. Now let's delete this bottom line as we won't be needing it. Finally, we will add the shadows and the highlights. I already determined where these will go when I drew my sketch. Press Command or Control Y to reveal the wireframes and see what we're working with. Let's select the colors, right click and ungroup to separate them into individual shapes. We will add a shadow to the nose. So let's select the nose shape and do a copy and paste in front two times. Select the top shape and move it up. You can see a gap that was created. Select the top two shapes and activate the Shape Builder tool. Holding Option or Alt, delete the top shape. Give it a darker color to create the shadow. Following this method, let's add the remaining highlights and shadows. And there you have it everyone, this is how you create Super Mario in Adobe Illustrator in my style. I hope you enjoyed the tutorial and let me know your thoughts in the comments. Cheers everyone!